guys, it's Inspirational Nails, and this is a video response. This video response is for Keegan Candles, and her YouTube is Keegan68. Uh, so if you love candles, um, you should really stop by her channel. Um, she sells some amazing candles um, from what I've seen from the ladies that have sh um, showed and reviewed them on YouTube. I haven't personally, personally had one, um, but... They look amazing. <laughs> they look like they smell amazing. Um, so this this um, stamp that she has here is in the back of the envelope that the card came in. And the um, giveaway challenge was to take her business card, which I'm going to show in a minute, and creatively post it um, in an area where you know, people can see it and be creative with it. So I hope you like what I came up with on making her card creative, um, on posting it, and also where I am going to put it. Unfortunately, I got the card today, so I didn't have time to go to where I'm going to take it to, and I will be taking it to the location that I'm going to announce in a few minutes. But, um... This is uh, the stamp that she has in the back of her, in the back of the envelope, and it says Keegan Candles for all your candle needs, and it has her phone number. That is her email address, and also she has um, a website. Okay, um, so I'm going to show you what the card looks like, and this is the business card, and she makes homemade soy candles which is so that is also something very different you don't normally see that and um, it has a great you know added bonus not just that she makes just regular candles but they are soy candles and uh, her name is Brandy Keegan and again this has her all her information on there so what I am going to do with this little card is I'm going to cut it <gasps> Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> I gotta have some humor in this, right? So, am I gonna cut it? Yes, I am going to cut it. But, when I come back, you're going to see what I've done. Hi, guys. <laughs> so, I'm back. And as you see, I've cut the card. Uh, it wasn't too bad. It wasn't too bad. As you see, this is all I cut from the card, and I'm going to show you why I have cut this part of the card. So I wanted it to stand out where it was different, and it was noticeable, where people will really look at it and say, hmm, what is that? What's in there? And kind of be able to more focus on what the card is about in hopes that people go to her site. Now this is of course taking me longer than expected. <laughs> okay guys, bear with me a minute. Okay, I'm almost done. I'm almost done, I promise. So here we go. This is my final product. And this is how I feel that it is a great way to advertise um, the business card. I put it in a frame. And all it is is a tiny little picture frame. I got it from the Dollar Tree. And the really cool thing about this is, of course, it sits up, which I'm going to show you how it looks. And there is her card. And I'm going to just back up a little bit. So this is how I think would be a great way to put out her card. 
um, a little bit different than just posting it on a bulletin or um, you know things of where normally how they put up a card and also the place that I was going to take it to um, which I was hoping to get it during uh, the weekend so that I can take it to is um, the spa and the reason why I was going to take this to the spa is because a lot of women love candles and especially when they go to the spa that's one of the biggest things that you have in there is the mood and candles and I think um, for it being in a spa area where maybe like where the magazines are or um, maybe other people who put little postings up you can just put the the little picture frame and people will look at it and say oh what is that and her information is all on there so um, I hope you like my creative way on how I would post your card so until the next one